guys, this is Chetan Bhagat Times, and you're watching a quick uh, gaming review of uh, the Vivo Z1X. So this is uh, the Z1X that's going to launch in India pretty soon. And so we are told uh, we could do the gaming review, so that's what we are doing here. It would be the PUBG Mobile gameplay, and right now the battery is on 100%. The temperature here is uh, this. It's about 30 degrees on the front of the device, and about 31.7, 31 degrees, around 31 degrees on the back of the phone and uh, to talk about the chipset it's uh, Qualcomm Snapdragon 712 mobile platform that was the same on the Vivo Z1 Pro as well so the Z1X and the Z1 Pro have the same power with the Adreno 616 GPU and of course there are variants uh, with a uh, different amount of RAM and storage options here so before we start uh, the speaker is located towards the bottom even the headphone jack is present towards the bottom of the device and we'll be playing our regular ID uh, not a guest ID this time at least uh, and under graphics settings you could see it has HD and high option smooth has ultra We'll start with Smooth and Ultra for now and under the graphics you also have the option for uh, changing the notch settings. You can have it normal uh, rounded corners or notched. We kept it to normal. Earlier it was on notched and that would create a gap on this side and uh, towards the right side. But we are okay with uh, losing some of the uh, content here. But we wanted buttons to be on the corner. So that's the reason why I thought let's uh, go with this uh, option of normal. I'll turn off the matching and uh, we'll start a classic game. Try to do a hard drop to see how it works and uh, how it goes and how is the phone able to handle things. So just to confirm again, uh, let me go to the graphics settings and uh, it's smooth and ultra here. So we'll drop in poaching key. And this gaming review would be particularly for those who actually uh, uh, are quite well Acquainted with PUBG Mobile, who knows things and who knows when lags occur and when uh, frame drops would uh, be expected and uh, what are the lags that happen inside the game and not because of the phone but because of the server issues that the game has. So uh, you will obviously understand all those things by yourselves but uh, still we will try to show you whenever possible if there is a lag or anything here. And since it's a hot drop expect us to die and uh, start another game but that's perfectly okay for us. So the phone also has a 4500 mAh battery uh, and uh, it comes with a 22.5 watt charger uh, so for fast charging this surely should be a good phone uh, but the battery is not as same as what was seen on the Vivo Z1 Pro which had a 5000 mAh battery. A uh, little lag here or even a small frame drop. So it's not really that smooth but uh, let's keep playing. So the speaker is not that strong uh, but that's okay we'll be playing these kind of games with uh, the earphones
obviously a bit hard to control there uh, that's okay um, it felt a little laggy uh, but not so much as well it was quite decent so far uh, and that was on smooth and ultra ultra is the frame rate that you can play on this and um, that's a smoother gameplay so uh, smooth and ultra let me change it to hd and high while if we keep playing well and uh, if the game continues i'll try to also show you whether uh, it performs the same back when we go to smooth and ultra for now it's hd and high the highest possible graphics that's hd and uh, uh, the high frame rate so ultra and then there's extreme as well but extreme is not possible on snapdragon 712 ultra is where you get about 40 to 45 uh, frames per second of uh, the uh, frame speed and uh, frame rate and uh, mm, this is hd and high uh, high is even lower amount of frame rate but here what you see is the graphics uh, get better here this time we get the georgia pole crates and let me mark that so uh, this time we'll see if it uh, does well So this is the HD and high option. There's certainly some lag, it's not uh, the smoothest. Though we haven't seen those huge frame drops that you expect from some of the chipsets. So it's not the worst of it, but uh, there are some lags that you could notice here. So we'll play another game as well and uh, so far it's not bad, it's still decent enough and uh, I won't say it's the best because uh, frankly I felt the Vivo Z1 Pro was not lagging as much having the same chipset but uh, this one showed a little bit of a lag and uh, that was exactly when uh, we were trying to focus on the player earlier, not this last one, the last one was obviously a noob uh, decision to go out but the before one uh, when scoping in uh, there was a lag which you would have noticed and uh, those things were quite well controlled in the Vivo Z1 Pro though we'll have to keep playing and when, then we can judge whether it's actually one of the issues or not. But so far I would say again uh, compare this to some of the other phones uh, with the 710 chipset uh, from Realme and uh, the Snapdragon 675 as well from Xiaomi, Redmi Note 7 Pro, the Realme uh, X and the Realme 5 as well, 5 with the uh, not the 710 chipset. Uh, their thing was that there was um, uh, again some issues with the uh, obviously with the Redmi uh, Realme 5 we had uh, uh, some complaints with the Xiaomi Mi A3 as well we had some complaints about the possibility of graphics here uh, it's better with that with the possibility of graphics it shows ultra under uh, smooth which was not present uh, on those phones so if this lands in the same price range then obviously this is a better choice because uh, uh, it doesn't totally suck with the gaming quality, it does uh, decent enough uh, graphic uh, out there. So this would be the largest, last game, I'll try to go back to smooth and ultra because most of you would play the game under smooth and ultra and would want us to show more gameplay with that. 
and uh, that's what we'll do here and just a quick gameplay that was, as soon as we end this uh, that would be the end of it and we'll show you whether uh, there was a lot of battery drain or not So under smooth I'll be frank it's not bad at all it, it's doing quite well under smooth option So this is where you see the smoothness if it's smooth enough to totally uh, quickly change the scope and scope in and play.
this just to give you a demo uh, how well is this performing so so far i felt that under smooth if you also noticed it did quite well and there was no huge issue with the performance under hd and high obviously i saw some lags but under smooth it was good enough otherwise you won't be able to deal with the enemies in this way you would be already killed uh, with the lags that you have so here uh, it was good enough uh, with the snapdragon 712 edge of 600 gpu So I guess that's it, uh, we'll end it here and uh, mm, this was the gameplay on the Vivo Z1 X that's going to launch soon in India with the same chipset that the Vivo Z1 Pro had, Adreno 616 GPU and the Snapdragon 712 processor and uh, not a bad uh, chipset for gaming and not a bad uh, gaming phone also uh, but before we end this, obviously I'll play the game later, continue with it later uh, let me show you the battery and everything here. So the battery percentage is 95% uh, uh, right now and uh, that is with the amount of game that we played. Let me show you that as well. From 100 to 95 is what it went to and 67% is drained by the uh, game. 29 minutes. So out of 29, I guess about 20 minutes was the actual game that we played. So 20 minutes and 5% of battery drain. Uh, about 7% for one full game is what we expect uh, to drain there. And also the temperature here it's gone up to 40 degrees which is not bad uh, it's not feeling that uncomfortable and uh, on the back as well it's about 40 degrees not more than that 40.2 is the max that we see here so that's it about the gaming on the vivo z1 x smartphone uh, this was quite a decent phone uh, there were some lags that we had seen and expected as well but uh, in the end i feel that this was not a bad phone for gaming and uh, that's it here. I hope you like this video. If you do, do share and uh, subscribe to Gizmo Times for more. Thanks for watching and see you in our next video.